I'm Kelly Thayer, and I'm pleased to be joined by Michelle Vopel from ESPN.com. Thanks so much for joining us here. Mm -hmm. Michelle, 2014 has been just a dream season for the LPGA with so many great storylines. When you look back on this year, what's going to stick out most to you? Can I say a tie for number one? It would be Michelle Wee winning the U.S. Women's Open, which I thought was it, it was very emotional because, you know, this is somebody who's, you know, taken a lot of hits for no reason, I, I think. You know, she was a young kid who came up very, very young, had, had success, then didn't have as much success, and everybody was like, oh, she's washed up when she was still a teenager. And it was really neat to see her get this victory, something she worked very hard for, and to play so well on such a tough course. So that's tie for number one, and the other one for me would be Mo Martin. Um, it's kind of the opposite story of Michelle Wee, somebody who, who you know, really had to pay her dues, but spent six years basically on uh, the LPGA's developmental circuit. The look on her face when her caddy came and told her at the, at the Women's British Open, hey, you've won it, it was just like complete disbelief. And that's, that was a big life-changing moment for her. So those two tie for me as the best moments of the LPGA season. So many key moments, so many special emotional moments. And now we're looking ahead to 2015. 33 events on the LPGA schedule, Solheim Cup in Germany, so many exciting things. What are you most looking forward to? Uh, you know, Solheim Cup's hard to not say that's your number one because it's going to be in Germany for the first time. I think it's going to be incredibly well received in Germany. I saw Steffi Graf actually on Facebook and tweeting about that, you know, the tennis great, talking about how excited she was. So. That's really cool. The other thing I'm really looking forward to, though, is sort of the new LPGA Championship, if you will, the KPMG Women's PGA Championship, which will be at Westchester Country Club. I, I, I'm looking forward to that, you know, a new home for it um, and a new name for it, and I think just a new excitement level about that tournament. I mean, it is, you know, one of the premier tournaments in, in all of golf, I think, and I think there's a lot of uh, for, for people who follow the LPJ, I think are looking forward to this sort of new era for that for that major. It's going to be exciting. All about elevating women and leadership at mm -hmm. that event with the Women's yeah. Leadership Summit. A lot to look forward to in 2015. Make sure to follow along for LPJ news throughout the off season on LPJ.com, and be sure to tune in when we kick off the 2015 season at the Coates Golf Championship.